Loves. welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing great today i'm going to show you guys how i put my clochette that i just picked up i revealed it on my last video and i figured i'd show you guys how i'm going to put it onto my speedy b25 maybe you guys will find this video helpful obviously this will apply not only for the speedy b25 but all bags in general as you guys can see in my background i just finished filming my last video where i unboxed this one along with my toiletry 26 i cover prices and all of that in that video so if you guys are interested check that video so i hope you guys find this video helpful and let's get started so i switched up the angle just because i feel like you guys will be able to see what i'm doing a little better and here is the clochette this is how it usually comes with it is in two pieces this is the one that comes with the alma bb and I want to kind of hang it on my Speedy B25. So it is in two pieces. And I like the fact that this one, this one does say Louis Vuitton made in France. I'm sure you guys can't really catch that because of the light. And I have over here my lock that came with the Speedy B and also the keys. So I'm going to show you guys um, how it goes originally or how my essay showed me. So pretty much you grab this long part right here which has a little small cut and a bigger cut. So you put it over the small cut just like so and then you're supposed to put this through the small little hole right here. that's how it looks like after you put it through the bigger or the smaller hole and you loop it through and then that's how it should look so this is what's gonna go through inside of this little I guess clochette pocket portion and you're supposed to just pull through like so and then you're supposed to do the same thing with the bigger loop this is the way that you are supposed to do it i'm trying to see if there's a way to kind of make it so it doesn't bulge out as much you guys can see how much is bulging out so let's take this back out so i've been playing around with this for a cool minute now trying to figure out like the slimmest way to go about it and this might be crazy but i feel like this would be the slimmest way to go around it so you guys can see that these keys do they all come with this little ring and so what i tried doing was actually hooking the ring into the hole so maybe i don't have to make that knot and so i don't know if you guys can catch what i'm doing so i hooked up the actual ring into the key hole right there and i feel like looking at it how it goes or how it sits it looks like this would be like the slimmest way to go about it this is not a piece that is going to be pulled on or really played around with so i don't think that there's going to be a problem with this kind of stretching out over time i've been playing around with this so just make sure that when you click it through you start clicking it off on the shorter side versus like the longer side because as you guys can see it kind of hangs better in the sense of if you were to hang it on this side then because of this longer tip right here the key kind of leans on this side instead of more of a gradual look if you guys know what i mean so let me try it out with the clochette and show you guys what that looks like so most definitely it is a lot slimmer you guys can see how it doesn't bulge out at all and the only thing that you pretty much have sticking out here would be like a little bit of that ring but it actually looks pretty good i think what do you guys think so from here on what you would have to do you would grab this put it through the loop on whichever ring you want to you would open up this loop I'm wondering if I should put the keys in through first, maybe that'll be easier. You guys will see how there's a blank part here and a part with the line. So this is supposed to be the front and this is supposed to be the back. So let's loop it through the front and see what it looks like. I feel like it's going to just look flatter that way. So there you go. So most definitely, I feel like if you use the front part to loop it in instead of clicking it and looping it through the back, it's going to look a lot flatter and a lot cleaner. So that's kind of like the look that I'm going for. That's what it looks like. Do you guys see that? So it just kind of looks more like it's kind of leaning. It's all kind of 
facing forward and this is actually pretty flat too which i like and i was actually thinking of maybe hanging this lock over it as well so let's actually try that So what do you guys think? Let me know what you guys think about this look, whether it kind of you like it better with the lock or without the lock or just a clochette hanging. So yeah, I think this is kind of like the look that I'm kind of going for. And if anything, maybe I could hang the lock up here. I don't know. I'm still going to try to figure out and play with it a little more. So I'm constantly playing with it and I feel like this would be actually a lot better if you're trying to just link the keys the way i did um i feel like it would be better if you guys are like if you guys are crazy like me where there's like one way or the other i feel like it would be a lot easier to try to figure out which way you would like it to sit better so like i said always um do front in front so front and front so i have the lines on both sides showing so whether you like this look better where you'll have this pointy thing sticking out towards the outside or if you like the other look which would have to be obviously the other way only that you're gonna be linking everything the same way and then now you have this corner part sticking out the inside and then if you hook this up you have to kind of think that it's going to be um, going outwards so I feel like that would be like the better way to go and then kind of pulling it up and then linking the keys would be a lot easier I think I like mine this way where I have this thing sticking up to the outer side of the bag instead of the inner side and then have my clochette hanging so now that I have that I can just get my keys and then lock it in there by how i just showed you and then it would be like a good like a good look so that is all i have for you guys in this video i really hope you guys found it helpful if you did please give me a thumbs up i hope you guys have a great day or night and i'll see you guys on my next video bye guys